Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for giving me a voice. Today we're talking about hydrogen potential of, and plans of replacing in Pakistan the coal dependent fuel into hydrogen for renewable sources. My talk would be delivered basing two articles. First, article evaluating renewable energy sources for implementing the hydrogen economy in Pakistan, MCM approach, and which is uh, published in 2019 in a case of environmental science and pollution research was produced for work of Chinese research from Nanjing in China under Li Xu professor leadership and how it was developed in 2023 in case of uh, in case of uh, solar in by article of Professor Shah from Energies, which is recently working for University of Sanyo in Italy and was published in relation a number of analysis for environmental life cycle analysis of energy payback period evaluation of solar PV systems, the case of Pakistan. The, 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 the work is saying to free, there are several things. In case of first, as how hydrogen is so important to reduce greenhouse effect and huge, uh, huge potential of using solar, geothermal, and uh, and and wind energy. Not about wave here, but important as well as using municipal ways that are may even for two billions uh, even uh, for 20 percent of deaths in the country so so this is the case, what is potential uh, of the, the biomass and municipal waste because it's 5 billion tabs in the country per year are linked to garbage bomb diseases. And how is developed basic the sun? And solar development, because solar, according to Shark Professor, is replacing, fuel fossil is replacing and removing the case mostly, nitric and sulfur oxides, which are very dangerous to health. The, in case of volatility of recent photovoltaic, Duration of payback is estimated 12 and shorter than expected life span of the solar. So, life span would be 24, the new most recent made, and, and growth is 6%, not 4, and due to benefiting of